Freak Master. So today I'm going to be reviewing the Lego Friends Heart Lake City Downtown Diner, which retails for approximately $30 US, which if you actually see online, it's like $29.99, but like, who cares? Anyways, so it is $30 with three mini dolls, which one is exclusive at the moment, and has, let me see, 346 pieces, and it is six plus, so for older kids to do it. So yeah, let's start with the figures. So yeah, let's go. <laughs> the first mini doll we get is Aaliyah, and she has nothing exclusive to her besides her accessory which was, which is this little like journal, which she has the sticker of it and a little pen in the light aqua, which is a common friends piece that came in a lot of sets. Her torso came in another set, which is like a four plus set, which I thought was the other one, which I'll show a picture of which one I thought it was. I thought it was that torso, but it's definitely not. So the legs are a new mold, which has the little thin joint and the little weird bottom and a little pearl gold not even pearl pearl gore what the heck am i saying anyways it's some pink and then we have some back torso printing and obviously there's no extra head on the back and we have her hair which if you don't know has a little pinhole on the top next up is leanne which i think she has a boring outfit like this outfit came in four sets probably would come more because we need to see the next summer wave or this summer wave so her hair is this like little braided up thing up top or like little bun her face is just a normal smiling i feel like you can use it as a boy face as well i don't know why but you can she is in the medium tan skin color her jacket is in denim which is the same as all the other four sets and i also i also showed the torso which was used or looks similar to a different one her legs is okay which you can use for both boys and girls and the back torso has some printing like little i don't know like stickers or something like that and the skateboard is pretty boring and also she gets this hair hat combo which it's okay it's a bit bigger than the city ones and has the little pinhole at the back and obviously she has a weird little new mold next up is my favorite one charlie which he didn't get any accessories but that's okay because he looks cool so he has this new hair or not hair but the new hair color which is in the light aqua and it's the little mohawk like pointy hair one he has like these greenish eyes sand green no not sand green but like a very light green actually i think it's sand green and he gets this like striped work top or like torso with this little apron on and he has these like little dress piece but with like some air jordans or something and he also gets back torso printing it would be nice if he had an extra face but we'll get into that later then we get a side bill which is this is the only side bill for some reason besides the skateboard so it's this little chair area where you sit outside which i have an idea to put it on top of the roof i don't know why i always do that but we get this little two but i meant one by four sandwich it's a basic one but comes in this new piece in the tan we have these chairs in coral which i don't really like coral that much but it has the new piece but in a coral which is a more common color for it to come in coming in a couple sets like autumn's house we get this good build for a napkin holder or whatever you just get the napkins there that's a very clever idea and some reason you could pop these off i don't know where why would you pop them off to flip them the wrong way Maybe you could just flip it like that. I don't know why they build it like that, but anyways. Now let's get on to the actual diner. Okay, so here is the actual downtown diner, or the Heart Lake Diner. So it is a remake, basically a remake, of the 2012 Heart Lake City Cafe restaurant. I forgot what it was. City Park Cafe, I think that's what it's called. So we have the same design with the roof with the red and white but this time instead of pink it's white we get this new little black cat which i forgot to show it has a little pinhole looks a little weird but it's the new friends it's kind of animals so you get the sticker of the diner which you can obviously just pop off and you can just move the sandwich spin it around and then um the architecture is a bit different from the actual friends one from 2012 with these little pillars but in the coral and we get these leaves which i don't really like them that much the red roses look a bit tacky especially the coral i don't really like this new kind of design but it's clever how they made these little curves we get more of the little it's pretty much symmetrical but we get the sticker of the wanted black 
Katie. So like there's some storyline in this. We get a little sticker of a drive through area and we're just going to switch to the side real quick, which we have, let me just, the menu where it is just saying the sandwiches, which is $5. It kind of reminds me of checkers because of the little checkers, but that's it. We don't get nothing here. This is obviously where they pick up the stuff. And then on the other side, there's pretty much nothing besides the mechanism, which I'll show you how to do that inside. So here we get the sticker and this new bright light yellow for the door frame. And now let's go inside. The here building. is the inside of the Heart Lake Diner. And we have this green trash can, which is actually a side bill. I don't know why I didn't mention it, but we get the little area to make food, which we get bread, tomatoes, lettuce, and cheese, which I'm going to zoom in real quick. And we also get a little sticker of Charlie, which is because he says he's the employee of the month because he's the only employee here, apparently. And then we get the order, a little menu board saying what orders have been completed and which are to come. We get sodas. And it'll be cool if they print it on them. We get this little container, which has a couple of stuff, which I will show right now. Container contains very of different color, but we get two of pretty much everything. And that's pretty much it. It's a clever build to put on there for the little, I guess, fridge. So then we get this area, which is the little cash register. You can see it right there. These two loaves of bread. And we get a $100 bill and a five cent thing, which is a nickel. And then on this side, we can zoom out. We get this little arcade machine, which reminds me of Happy Mrs. Chicken from that Peppa Pig episode. I'll show the picture of it on screen. And you can attach or detach it and just reattach it if you want to, which you can obviously do that anytime if you want. Also, we get the little boom box. It's our juke box. That's what it's called. So you have, you put a little quarter in it or nickel. And then you just move this little mechanism back and forth. It's a bit weird. I don't know why, but it's okay. I think they should have add like the little rainbow like colors on the side to make it go up there. That would be really cool. Or they could have had like a color, a glow in the dark brick in there, but they don't have that in here. We get this checkered pattern in dark blue and white, which makes kind of no sense why they're curved. They could have used extra one of these and just put them there and then curve it right here or not have the curve at all I mean, that's a better idea but that's pretty much it for the downstairs so upstairs we get nothing which this is why i wanted to put the little food area up here just because i don't know i don't want it just to be sitting out here and when i modify this or put it in the city i don't want it to have like random pieces like sticking out everywhere like just like randomly sitting over here so i'll just decide to put it up here but we get to see how the sandwich moves up you can see where it's like weird you can see the little light bright yellow in the sun back there's pretty much nothing up here besides you can see the downstairs and so yeah here is the box which this is why i said they needed a face rinse i just really wish charlie had a different face than his like weird like just boring like normal face and we also get like the numbers and whatever. And on the side we see pretty much this basic thing. Lego friends on the side with a new logo. We also get this, which is like just basic thing that they're doing now. And then little side art on the side. Anyway, so here is the last part of the video. I get my thoughts and what they could have added. So this set for $30 is okay. I don't really like coral especially in certain builds this one just doesn't really look that great in it for my opinion the red roses look a bit tacky i don't know i don't really like the that color scheme i really prefer the old friends one the base plate being purple or lavender is a bit tacky as well i wish it was like the light bright light blue or whatever it was called because that would make a reference to the old friends one and that will be better um maybe they could add this to be a little bit wider for more vehicles to get in extra face prints please add extra face prints different outfit for Aaliyah or leanne just because it's i don't want this crappy leanne's outfit just because it's so bad i'm i think i'm gonna probably sell it on ebay or whatever um and charlie could have an extra face print or extra outfit just because 
if you see him outside of work i don't think he's gonna be wearing the same apron and the torso like that but obviously we get more light nougat skin colored people so it could be a little easier to switch them out but anyways out of five i'll give this set a three just maybe it could have added some stuff to it it will be better that's just all i'm saying extra face prints the cat is okay i think it looks a bit weird but a lot of people seem to find it super cute so four i'm at three out of five so i hope you enjoyed this video like and subscribe turn on notifications to be notified when i post a new video and hope to see you in my next video so bye